Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. In which module are you registered? Creo que hubo un error, teacher, en lo que nos mandaron ahora, supongo. Creería que sí. ¿Ustedes iniciaban ahora? No. <risa> Porque este Estamos es... en el grupo, ajá, en otro grupo estábamos con el teacher, con otro teacher. Maximiliano. Ajá. Sí, porque este es intermedio 5. No, no, no. Nosotros somos intermedio, ¿qué? ¿Tres? Sí, es un, eh, Maximiliano Lazo de León. Ajá. Exacto. Eh, Wendy, ¿y si entramos a los enlaces anteriores? Sí, a los, a los, eso estoy pensando que a los... A los Anteriores voy a entrar. Ajá. Sí, porque, porque realmente sí. el enlace no cambia. El enlace es el mismo siempre. Paola, buenas noches. Entonces, sí, vamos al, al, al otro. Eh, sí, yo le recomendaría que busquen ¿no? el enlace anterior que les mandaron porque eh, no es este su modo. No tendrían que cambiar, ¿verdad? Ok. Está bien, Tichi. Sí, vamos a salir entonces. Si no, lo pueden, si no lo pueden reportar al grupo y ahí les van a ayudar. Alguien de soporte le va a ayudar. Ok, teacher. Okay. Nice okay, to meet you. Nice to meet you. No problem. Me. Nice meeting you nice too. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Have a good one. Enjoy your class. See you, see you next module. <laughs> Let's hope so. Let's hope so. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> ok. Yep, and I got more people coming here. Adriana de Carmen. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Ramon Enrique. Hello, Ramon, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. What about you? I'm just fine, just fine. You're ready to start the class. Okay, I'm just uh, waiting for my for my girl for of your of her jobs. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. And is it far from your house? Is it? Does it take you long? Uh, is like uh, fifty minutes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, it's not that much. 15 minutes, it's okay, right? Yeah. Um, between 10 and 15 minutes. Okay, that's, that's nothing, actually, you know. Okay. But I, I can listen to the class. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Let's see, Marcos. Hello, Marcos. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. fine. Uh, happy to finally uh, is the end of the weekend. The, the week. Yeah, we are going to start the weekend, and that's always good, right? You can rest. Yeah, yeah, I can I can rest. I can, I can hang out for a while. And how, how are you, teacher? I'm just fine, just fine. Mm. 
Okay. Just okay. let me let me do something here. Don't go, don't go. Okay. Now give me a second. Let's see. Okay, the same area. Perfect. Okay, let's see. So, Marcos, tell me, what's the plan for the weekend? What you gonna do? Plan for the weekend. Um, tomorrow, on the first hour, I have to take a class from the university at 10 p.m. Uh, 7 p.m. Um, oh, really? Yeah, yes. So I had to wait, wake up early. But then uh, we have planned to go to the beach for a while. Uh, also, right now it's windy, <laughs> kind of weird. That's yeah. all the wind appears. Yeah, well, you know, this is El Salvador. Here the weather is something kind of crazy, right? Yeah, yes. Because uh, during the day it was hot for me, I think. Yeah, no, actually it was it was hot. Yeah, and now yeah. it's it starts getting cold, but it's gonna be a good night for sleeping. Yes, yes, yes. It's a good um hour for the end of the week. Yeah, sure. So you're yes. going to the beach. Tell me, which beach are you going to visit? Um, I don't know the name. The is located in La Libertad. Okay. Some of, some of that um, beach. Uh, we are going to we are going to visit. Um, we are we are going to see it during the journey. <laughs> What happened? Okay, what well. place we end up? Let's hope everything is okay. And you yes. can enjoy your weekend. Welcome to the class, mister. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Thanks. Ada, hello, Ada. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Uh, Good evening. Great to A lot of work. And for surgery and the insurance and two surgeries in the private hospital private. And oh, really? Yes, teacher. I arrived at home um, 20 minutes. <laughs> I carry up uh, the sanitation um, protocol okay. and, prepare, and prepare the class. Oh, and the teacher <laughs> and Saturday and work in the cleaning and for fat pe patient and, okay. and and I'm sorry to ask you this again. What is exactly your specialty? Cirugy vascular. <laughs> Cirugia vascular. Yeah, what are we talking about there? It's a uh, um, it's a um, cateterismo, no sé cómo se dice. Cateterismo, okay. cateterismo cardíaco, cerebral, coronario. Oh. It's a specialist, it's a um, big special. Yeah, specialty. Specialty. And Sunday. Um, and a sleep teacher. <laughs> okay, well, that's cool. That's cool. You need to rest. Yes, teacher. Excellent, excellent. And you, teacher, your day? My day, let's see. Wow. Well, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Uh, working in the morning, working in the afternoon, teaching. Then I came home. I went to the gym. And let's see. And now you're in class. Yeah. 
tomorrow is going to be interesting because uh, uh, we got some activities program in the family. That's, that's something nice. And my son's got a fight. So it's going to be interesting. We will see how everything comes up. Thanks for asking. Ada, thank you. No, thanks to you. Welcome. Good. Susanna. Hello, Susanna. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. I finished work out. Oh, really? Yes, teacher. That's <laughs> I, nice. <laughs> yes, I, I, it's the moment. Uh, I drive. Are you driving? Okay. Uh -huh. We will talk I, later. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> Be safe. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Let's see. Uh, uh, Stephanie. Hello, Stephanie. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm doing great. Um, today was not a busy day. Was not a busy day. So, oh, really? um, yes, and I arrived at home uh, a little bit, no, a few minutes later. No, a few minutes. No, I want to say que llegué unos minutos antes. <laughs> a few minutes ago? Uh, yes, sorry. I arrived home a few minutes ago because my my father uh, go to to my job and they give me a ride <laughs> to my oh, really? home. Yes, she gave me. I, she gave me a ride. She gave me a ride because I usually I have to wait. I have to wait until seven for the transportation uh, in my job, <laughs> and I go. Oh. Up it. Yes. Yeah, that's bothersome. Yeah. I mean, waiting and waiting. Yeah, that's something I don't really really like yeah but yeah when when you wait for transportation it, it goes like that <laughs> i do because uh it takes me the same time when i go to the bus because i have to take two buses so i oh. have to wait so okay, it's kind where do of you, the same where do you live san salvador in ilopango, ilopango. oh really mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> it's I, kind gonna, of two hours. I'm gonna be there tomorrow. Oh my god! I have to work yeah, <laughs> but but I'm gonna be by the city hall. The uh, city hall. No, but yeah, it's it's really far away. I think. But, oh, well, okay. maybe yeah. for my job. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be there tomorrow afternoon. My son's got a, an event. So he's going to be there in the afternoon. He's got a fight. It's going to be interesting. Mm, interesting. Yeah. yeah, we will see how it goes. <laughs> well, I hope everything goes. Yeah, let's hope so. Let's hope so. And yeah, that was my day. I didn't do anything special. <laughs> Not much. Yeah, not much today. Oh well, the only difference was today, and just two supervisors go to the to the office because um one have the off, the other one get sick, and the other one to get sick. So I just was kind of thinking about if the day is gonna be will be will be um maybe a little bit stressful because. Three of them were no. Three of them weren't in the office, but everything is so uh, very good. I think. Okay. Well, interesting. Yeah. Thank, thank you very much for being here and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Jacqueline, hello, Jacqueline. How are you? Hello, good evening. Good evening, how are you? 
Uh, I'm fine, thank you, teacher. I'm very happy because it's Friday. <laughs> oh yeah, everybody is. And tell me, what's the plan for the weekend? Mm, well, I have many plans. I, you know, I'm a mother. And tomorrow I'm going to go to the supermarket to buy food and other things. And the rest of the day, I I will uh, rest because I'm very tired. And um, for Sunday, uh, I don't have any plan yet, but I would like to visit some friends or relatives. Um, relatives. Relatives. Thank you, relatives. Um, at morning. Uh, in the morning. In the in morning. The morning. In the morning, yes, thank you. In the morning. And, and that's it. That's all my plans for the weekend. Okay, well, that's nice. That means you're gonna be busy. <laughs> yeah. Thank that's you. Cool. No, thanks to you and welcome. Thank you. Okay, guys, please let me get the attendance before we move on. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Ambarelli Alparo Gómez. Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Uh, Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Aire Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Henry Neftalí Méndez Torres. I'm here, teacher. Eliana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. Present. José Marcos Rodríguez Ayala. Present. José Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present, teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present, teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Rebeca Jasmine Monterrosa Figueroa. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present. Blumen Frank Figueroa Peñate. Thank you, Blumen. Eh, Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Micro. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Ok, let's see, let's see, let's see. María Alejandra, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. I, I think that I feel tired, but I feel okay. But tired, but okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm happy because today finish the week. <laughs> and tomorrow uh, I will not uh, work up early, wake up early. <laughs> And what's the plan for the weekend? Um, I I don't have a plan um, because tomorrow I have a long day in the afternoon, in the night. Maybe uh, go to for the dinner or or a dessert and Sunday. I don't have a plan. Uh -huh. okay, this Sunday so don't have a plan. Nothing specific. Uh -huh, nothing. Uh -huh. Maybe I stay in a home or visit my mother for the 
uh, to visit the my pets and um, maybe um, sería bañarlas or, uh, shower or bath uh -huh, yeah, uh -huh, a bath uh -huh, for two because very dirty <laughs> Oh, uh, but you, got, that. you got dogs? Yes. How many dogs you got? Uh, I have two. Uh, one is a Pomerania and oh, it's, okay. it's very old. Okay, that's not a dog, that's a toy. Those things are. <laughs> yes, it's so pretty. Uh, they are the other... toys. <laughs> eh, it's a little bit tall compared to the Buffy, it's a the Pomerania, and the name is Chispita because it's very terrible. <laughs> Hard, sparky. Sparky would be, yeah, sparky. Oh, really? Uh -huh. <laughs> That's yes. nice. Uh -huh. And I think that only that. Maybe I. Uh, went go to my granny house, but for uh, see my cactus and transplay or no se tra plantar a plant, uh -huh, transplant a uh, pot, a different pot. Oh, okay. um, uh, move uh -huh. to a different pot. Uh -huh. Move a different pot, and I think that only that because all the all the things more expensive and the gas is expensive and all the expensive. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and maybe try to say uh, my gas. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Hey, Maria Alejandra, nice having you here. Welcome. <laughs> You're welcome, teacher. Thank you. Uh, Roxana, hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening, how are you? I'm fine. Okay, so tell me, what about you? What's the plan for the weekend? Mm, well, tomorrow I need to work, you know. I'm working on Saturday at the morning, in the morning. And after working, maybe i having lunch with my friends. And my son. Okay. And I don't know, in the at night, I hope I stay at home resting. And Sunday, I will go to the beauty. Hello. Beauty, yeah, beauty salon or beauty parlor. View at the beauty salon at in the morning and in the ref. In the rest of the day, maybe I will spend time with my family and go to the market and stay here. Nothing special. It will be a lazy weekend. Lazy? Lazy. Lazy. Or lazy? lazy. lazy. Okay. Yeah. Okay, well, the good thing is that you will have time to rest a little bit, right? Yeah, I try. I will try. Because in the weekend, the time is very short. You know, I need to organize my activities. And the weekend for me is very, very short. In my previous job, I didn't work i didn't work on saturday no oh, really? i didn't use yeah. to work I, I didn't use to work saturdays i didn't use to work on saturday so uh, the weekend now for me is too short yeah yeah i can imagine let's see hmm. i have never had saturdays off no, don't like them. You always work on, work on Saturday? Yeah, well, I, when I started teaching, let's see. Actually, 
Uh, Saturdays were pretty heavy for me when I was teaching at the university. Okay. Uh, like, like when I started, when I really, really started teaching was like 22 years ago, I started in Universidad Pedagogica. And I mean, weekends were packed. Saturday yeah. full until like 6 p.m. and Sundays morning, sometimes a couple of subjects. Yeah, it was pretty busy. I imagine. Well, uh, when I was in my previous job, I was studying in Yucca University. Uh -huh. I had a, a diploma, a diploma. And I remember that in the same time, I started to study the master. So I need to organize my time in my work my uh, extra classes at the at the UK University and the master class. It was very, very tight. We can always was studying. Yeah, it's a little bit stressful. Yes. And now I have a, a different stress. Yeah, of course. I know yeah. what you mean. <laughs> yes, but everything is okay. That's nice, yeah, that's I'm nice. Sorry. Excellent. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, let's see. Let's see who else is available. Francisco? Hello, teacher. Hello, Francisco. How are you? Just fine, teacher. Uh, huh? uh, yes, teacher. At home, in a, a little bit, uh, a little bit rest, <laughs> because tomorrow uh, I am going to work in the night. At night? Oh my gosh! Yes, teacher. At night. So Sunday you're gonna be like sleeping all morning. Yes, uh, uh, well, the problem in, in this moment in Acajutra, the weather is very hot. Yeah, I know. Well, right now is it hot? Yes, teacher. Because uh, here, here in San Salvador it's a little bit fresh. It's mm, windy actually. But I... Uh, uh, all the, the day the weather uh, was I, pretty hot. Yes, it's a really hot. Um, yeah. Teacher, how do you say uh, incluso? Even? Even. Uh, yeah. uh, even uh, this month, this month is uh, a little bit uh, more a little bit uh, fresh that uh, April. April really? uh, here is terrible. Mm, that's interesting. So that it means that I won't, I won't visit that place on April. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it's probably uh, because in, in this month uh, is the, the transition between uh, summer and in uh, in winter and and some and sometimes uh, uh, the, the the first uh, rains is the is the, the is the in, in this in this time is very is terrible. I, I think it's probably that uh, maybe, but the uh, humidity is humidity, right, teacher? Humidity, humidity. Okay, I, I think it's probably uh, in the, it's, uh, it's by uh, humidity. Yeah, so it's gonna be like terrible next month. Yes, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> in this time, you can uh, uh, use, uh, for example, to uh, fun, and is is not enough. 
<laughs> yeah, I know, I know. So, yes, yeah, sometimes it's like that. I mean, turning on the fan is not enough. I mean, sometimes you take a shower, turn on the fan, and five minutes after you are sweating. Yes, it's, yes. Here it is. It's terrible. <laughs> Yeah, I remember once when I was like 17, I spent 17, 18, I spent two months in a Catutla. Man, terrible. Teacher, in, in, which, uh, in which month uh, is was that? Let me see. Actually, it was going to start raining. So it must be like this, like. Oh. Uh, February, like March, yeah, between February and or March. It was in the 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 most the most hot month in the year. Yeah, I used to sleep, I used to sleep uh, and on the floor, you know, because it was so hot, and I used to shower many times a day. I I stayed at the I don't remember the name of the neighborhood right at the entrance. Mm. Uh, in the in the entrance. Yeah, but I don't uh, remember that. San, San Julian. No, no, no. Los Laureles. No. Nope. Mm. Uh, this the this neighborhood. Uh, this neighbor uh, uh, is uh, is in the entrance in the first entrance. Because uh, in the second entrance uh, is uh, uh, Ibu and Rasa Dos. Rasa. Ah, okay, teacher. Teacher, uh, I, I, in, this, in this moment, I'm living in the Rasa Dos. Oh, really? Yes, teacher. Oh, in West, I remember. Uh, uh, the thing is this. The thing is this, uh, we were fixing up a house. I was working at that time as an electrician. So we were working on a house over there and we stayed there. Actually, you know, that time when I came here, I got the, how do you call that? Uh, that illness, paludismo. Okay. <laughs> Man, it was terrible. <laughs> In, in, in all in all the Kahutla is is what is it's hot. It's yeah it is. I mean yeah but it's nice. I mean it was a nice experience for me. Hey Francisco, nice talking to you. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. And let's see, Fernando. Hello Fernando. Hello teacher, good evening. Good evening. You home early? Uh, not early. <laughs> a few minutes ago, I just arrived. In. Oh, weren't Fridays the short days for you? Yeah, but supposedly. Started, yeah, supposedly we started the closing. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So we forget about short days. Yes, yeah, correct. So. Uh, so perhaps next week you will have a short Friday. Next week, uh, mm, I do. <laughs> I doubt. <laughs> I I doubt it. Doubt it. I doubt it. I doubt Imagine it that that the T is an R. I doubt it. I doubt it. Okay. Like that. I person. doubt it. The the closing is two weeks. Oh, really? Yeah. So next week, Friday, probably we will finish or almost finish. So it's going to be heavy for you. Yes. Yes, teacher, but you know, the, the show must go on. Yeah, that's true. And I mean, the problem with jobs is that the philosophy of companies now is if you don't do it, there's somebody else who's going to do it the same as you, better than you, and cheaper. Yes. Yeah, you are not uh, indispensable. Yeah, I mean, expendable. 
Everybody is expendable. Expendable. Yeah, oh. everybody is expendable now. Yeah, but, you know, what can I do? Only yeah. do it. Yeah, keep on. I mean, there's no other option for us just to keep on and say what's up. Yeah, but I don't, I don't care, only, only tired, but okay. I used to, yeah. I used yeah, to work yeah. until too late. How, how many years have you been working for that company? Uh, three years. Oh, yeah. In three years, you I get have, used I, to that routine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the, the first year was, was terrible. Hard. Yeah, I can imagine. Yeah, Particularly yeah. if you are coming from a complete different environment. Uh, no, no. When when I was started this job, I I have have one year in in a similar work, but with oh, different okay. responsibilities. Yes, and before this this job, I I wore uh, how outsourcing in this company. Oh, as as outsourcing. As, as outsourcing in this company in, in the quality assurance area. But that word is 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 complicated, but is more no, it's easier than my actual job. Because actual the, actual actual that my actual job because um in my job, I, I have a, a lot of responsibilities. So oh, yeah, I understand I, you. Yeah, that happens. Uh, I try with, uh, I don't know, uh, many people in, in different countries. And sometimes it's complicated organizing time for all, for attending all. Yeah. And yeah. also you service, you service people from other countries also. Yeah, all the all the regions, Central America, the five Ooh. countries. Oh man, so for you it's complex. Uh, it's, it's complex. Some they are very hard. My my email never is uh, empty. Yeah, it's uh, never free, empty. Yeah, empty, empty. And my and my schedule, my calendar is never is free. Calendar, calendar. My calendar. Yeah, I understand. Well, you know, I stop. I stop uh, uh, taking down notes on my agenda about the calendar because, man, I'm always busy all the time. So it was like I was like trying to set out, like for tomorrow I'm gonna do this. Day after tomorrow I'm gonna be doing this. Man, I'm always busy. I'm receiving information, giving information, doing different stuff. So yeah. actually I got, I got like, I mean, instead of having one, I got like two. And I got oh. uh, uh, two agendas and I got okay. um, another notebook where I'm taking notes of some other info. Man, it's crazy. <laughs> so I understand you, I understand you, but in your position, it gets complicated. Yeah, it's complicated. It's complicated um, attending all people in, in that, these people feel uh, com complacidos uh, or feel, I don't know. Satisfied. Uh, satisfied, yeah. Because I always had uh, a queue, people in queue or similar, I don't know. Yeah, but, uh, but it's not easy. Uh, Another word that you could use is uh, this one. Look, yeah, and please, you can say please, please, oh, okay, please. instead of satisfied. Yeah, you can say please, please. Oh, okay, okay, and besides that, I have a, I don't know, I, I mean. Many was a group, and all the time is. is oh yeah. Had the car and, you know. Sometimes, sometimes it it becomes nagging, you know, that you are getting text after text, man. Yeah, 
uh, mostly some, when some, you are concentrated on something. Yeah, but some 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 topics and uh, that not belong to me, but I had to read uh, for for assure no for for be sure that topic not corresponding to my responsibility. And yeah, but it takes time, time from you. Yeah, yeah. time. No. Uh, and, and sometimes you are, has it happened to you that when you are more concentrated on something, messages start popping up? Yeah. And I have WhatsApp, I have things, I have sign now. So I had a lot of chat. So my my days are very um uh recuerdo la palabra hectic or hectic. 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 Yeah, are very hectic all the days, but I think that I, I just do that because uh, uh, I like, like I say, you uh, the first years was terrible, but today is normal for me all the day with, with the big queue. Yeah, I understand you well. Thank you, Fernando. Welcome. Thank you. Okay, guys, now first question. What was the last book you read? Do you like reading? If you do, which was the last book you read? What was it about? Let's talk about it and let's share with your classmates that info. I'm gonna divide you into small groups and you are going to have four minutes to ask and answer those questions, okay? Please jump in. So, Wilfredo, you cannot participate, right? Oops. Hello, mister. I was... Hello, hello, teacher. You cannot participate, right? Yes, teacher. Okay, I'll send you to a group just as a listener, okay? Okay, perfect, teacher. Thank you. No problem, no problem. Um, and, and well, I really that, that was the last time I read a book, so I didn't read anything when, was it? <laughs> when I was at the university. <laughs> really? 
Yes, I, I, I am not a, like that person that read a lot, really. I just, you, and also I don't see, for example, TV, I just see some series. Um, watch, watch. watch uh, sorry, watch series or movies or something like that, but I don't read any book. Sorry, I'm not that kind of person that like to read. <laughs> I don't know. How about you, Marco? The last time I read a book, I don't remember. I think it was in school. In, like in Vulture. <laughs> um, it was a book called Palmeras en la Nieve. I guess this is, this is Spanish. Mm. Yes, uh, I don't, I don't watch. Yeah, I, to be honest, I think that the last book that I read, it was a kid book. I read. Mm. I read okay, I read a kid book about um, short histor histories. Cuentos, how do you say cuentos? Tales. Historic. ¿Cómo? Tales. Tales. Like this. Tales. T A L E S. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Tales. So, to be honest, I don't read much. Read much. So I so for uh, for live to the dog o cómo se dice Peter, para salir de la duda to clear sorry <clears throat> yeah, to, but, clear. But to clear to clear okay but for that I I read the book again <laughs> to clear my doubts. To clear my doubt. Clear my oh, okay. Doubt. Okay. I, I mentioned I mentioned that to Jacqueline and Billman that the last book that I read was Edipo Rey. <laughs> because I have a dog. That I read. I read. That I read. That I read. Ah, in fact, Why you read it? Edipo. Yeah, why? Oh. Uh, I saw an article in internet or in internet. I don't know where where I saw, but uh, this article mentioned one part of the depot, and I think that uh, this part was different. So I had doubt, <laughs> and I went to read mm -hmm. the book again for clear my doubt. Yes. To be clear, in this case, it's to be clear. It's to be clear. Okay. Mm -hmm. But it's a small yeah. book. It's a small book, so. Yeah, deep already you read it like in a couple of hours. Tops. Yeah. yeah, that was my last book because uh, currently I, ha I have read. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't know in English, but Los Pilares de la Tierra. Oh. Let's see the name. I know that the original is it? in English. Yeah, can follow it. Yeah, can follow it. Yeah, can follow it. Yeah, I read it a couple of years ago. Yeah. Actually, I... there's a follow up of those. Sorry, did you... It's a series. Yeah, it's a series. This this book is the, the first of the trilogy. Mm -hmm. But it's it's very interesting. Yeah, I love them. I just love them. Yeah. Yes, really I, interesting, uh, historical, and and also the 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 pace of the book is for me was mesmerizing. I mean, I started reading it and I couldn't stop. Yes, that the the rhyme, no sé cómo se dice, the rhyme of the yeah. el ritmo de la escritura, the rhythm, the rhythm is is I don't know, it's, it's easy for for rhythm. Yeah. 
You know, the same happened to me with the Spanish author, uh, Arturo Perez Reverte. Arturo Perez Reverte. Oh. Yeah, check it out. Whenever you got the time, check, check him out. I mean, he's got pretty good books. Uh, okay. And it's funny, you know, because he's a Spanish uh, writer and I got to know him reading one of his books in English. Uh -huh. Okay, so it is easy to read. Uh, yeah. I have the, that experience with the I don't know, Diane Segerfield, the 13 Toe, El Cuento Número 13. Yeah, Tail. Okay, the 13 Toes, Tail. Tail, Tail. tail. Oh, Tail. Almost yeah. like, all, almost like cola, Tail. Tail, oh, tail, tail, yes. That book is easy for it. You can stop. <laughs> for the beginners. Can, yeah, you cannot stop because the right the rhythm is I don't know. It's easy for, for, for follow. It's easy to follow. What about you, Frank? Do you like reading? Yes, uh, not too much like like Fernando. But I read a few books on a year. The last, well, I'm reading right now some book about when. Well, the the writer is Noah Harari. A book called Homo Sapiens. It's about evolution. Oh, interesting. Of the humanities, like uh, some. That's that's heavy reading sometimes philosophical but it's very good yeah that's it, but it's heavy very good. reading it's very interesting because they he he told about the history of the human uh, he talked about homo sapiens neanderthal i don't know if he's correct in english neanderthal yeah neanderthals Neanderthal, yeah, and it's very interesting. Another book that that likes me a lot is a uh, One Hundred Years of Loneliness. I don't know if, if it's correct. Yeah, I know which one is it. Yeah, Gabo. Oh, yeah, you're talking about yeah, the Gabo. The Gabo. That's nice. Yeah, I love that book. I mean, I think. That yeah, is well, one. actually, I have read that one like four times. Yeah, I think that is one of the their best novels from from yes. him, right? For me, for me, in my opinion, I read some <clears throat> from some from that from him, Hi. but that is the one of my favorites. Oh, because I cool. like, I like him, her style, his style. It's like, I don't know how to say in English, realismo fantástico. I don't know. Yeah, I have no idea what is it called in English. To be honest with you. Yeah, but that is the, the style of, of him, right? Yeah. In my is case, that, let's see the. The last one uh, I was reading that was like like interesting, pretty interesting for me was a uh, 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 a series of books from Bernard Carnwell. And, well, actually, I have read two series of him, and but the last one I read was about. Uh, Richard Charpy, it was nice. But man, they were, yeah, there were more than 20 books, I guess. But do, do you read in English? Yeah. Okay. That's Have you read them? <laughs> no, you get used to it. You get yeah, used to it. I think, it just takes, I think. you know what? Uh, when I started reading English, uh, at the beginning for me was like, like heavy because I mean, 
I couldn't understand everything. And a, a tip that a friend of mine gave me was, don't try to be translating, don't try to be getting all the words and stopping and looking for a word that you didn't understand. Read the thing, try to get the main idea. Uh, from context, you are going to be, that's uh, uh, actually, that's a uh, uh, style of reading. Uh, when you get the meaning from context, uh, the first time I skimmed the book, just like passing by, you know, checking out what is it about, then I start uh, reading again. I mean, at the beginning, I used to read the books in English like two or three times. Okay. Can, can you recommend it? one book for for our level? <laughs> for beginners? Well, no, you're not beginners. You are, you're intermediate. Oh, I will have to think. Let me think about it because in your level, uh, I have to be careful because if I give you something that is too heavy or perhaps the vocabulary is mm, not heavy, but not in your, not the type of vocabulary that you know, it's going to become confusing. Like, I mean, there's a, there are little books, let's, like if you start reading um, in English, uh, what is the name of this author? He wrote La Balada de la Cárcel de Reading. I always forget the name of this guy. Let me look. Yeah, because I I like I like the the Middle Age, but in that context, it's complicated in English. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's like I tell you, I can I can give you a, a, a short book that is uh, from Oscar Wilde, but the English he used was complex. Okay, okay. So let me think about it. Hey, guys, it's time to go back. Okay. Okay. So Stephanie, Stephanie, you don't like reading, you told me, right? Yes, sorry. <laughs> uh, come on, it's fun, I love it. I do love it. I don't know, because maybe when I was at the university, because it was, I don't, I don't remember the name of the book, but it, it was a book that tell, tell us about all the history for, for the work. Uh, and when it start the the astrologicus and everything and there are some parts that are so interest interesting but there are another ones that get that make me We're boring for sleep. you yes <laughs> so maybe because i read the book in the night at night at night, at night, maybe for that, because I was so tired at that hour. And, you know, read a book at that hour and finish the homework and stuff like that, maybe for that. But sometimes what I did, <laughs> that it was better to me, 
is to search or, or watch some videos about that history that may be easy to, I don't know, to be, to get a visualization about what I was reading. Interesting. Yes. Very interesting. That I really don't like. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, what about you? Thank you, Stephanie. What about you, Maria Alejandra? Teacher, I can hear the question when you say, ah, I think that is, what is my last book? I, uh -huh. Yes, yep. no. Ah, okay. I read a book to a fantasy. Is a I I la corte de nieve de tinieblas y de niebla y furia. Y es a uh, to the Sara J Mas is a a Germany written is a saga. Okay. And, and I'm missing one book. And, and ¿cómo se dicen cortes, teacher? Cortes. Cortes. Ah, a different core, for example, to the ay, primavera, eh, verano, a different the seasons. Day, a, a different seasons in the year, and all the book divide a uh, different course and in this course I have a one for a uh, one core is a uh, the niebla oh. <laughs> a hawk and fog. Fog. fog is a fog and so you like the... fantasy yes I prefer the fantasy the suspense and okay, romantic. so you like about magical stuff? Uh huh. Hmm. Why don't yes. you read uh, Harry Dresden? Why? There's a series of books that it's called uh, Harry. Well, no, the series is called Dresden. Well, I don't know in Spanish. Let me. Let's me remember. Yeah, because the thing is, that's my problem. That I read them in English. Hold on. Yeah, but that's a, uh, 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 yeah. The Dresden Files. Yep. Okay, I search because I prepare to to read the last book, but it's very. Uh, this is it, the Dresden Files. It's uh, the author. It's uh, Jim Butcher. Good one, very good one. Okay, I search it's, and I have opportunity to read. Yeah, it's like eighteen books. So you can have fun. Ah, okay. Yeah, they, are, <laughs> I they, are not, they are not that big. I mean, they are not that big books, but they are very interesting. They are catchy. Ah, okay. But only that teacher, I don't read a lot of, but when I read, I spend a lot of time uh, to finish the book in the maybe, I don't know, but in a short time because I don't like to pen in a book because in my my state the my 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 imagination my, 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 yeah. my uh, work all the time and I try to <laughs> read more, read more. <laughs> yeah, that happens to me completely. That happens to me. I understand you totally. Okay, <laughs> thank you. And uh, nice yeah. activity. I, I'm sorry I cannot talk to all of you, but we I got caught up in this topic. I love reading. So whenever we talk about books, I get very excited. And some of you were asking me about which books could I recommend to you for reading? 
actually something, the first thing that I will recommend you is this, uh, read, look for a book in English that you have read already in Spanish. Because you know what it is about. In that way, when you are reading, you are going to start making connections between what you know and how those ideas are presented in English. That, that can be helpful. And look for books that are like, that were very interesting for you. Like, I don't know, uh, I mean, some people like uh, what? Harry Potter books, as an example. I mean, you watch the movie, then you read the book, or perhaps you just read the book and you start reading it in English, you will like making the, start making the comparison and connecting the ideas. That's something that it's very helpful. Believe me, uh, I used to do it when I was starting reading. I used to do that exercise also to read something that I had read read in Spanish, so I could I was not lost. Okay, I was not lost, and the few words or phrases that I was catching was helping me understand where was I in the plot of the book. That's that's an advice that I could give you, and believe me, it's helpful, it's pretty helpful. Okay, guys, let me get the second attendance, please. Hey, Rebecca, hello. Let's see. My teacher. <laughs> Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Ambarelli Alfaro Gómez. Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Jairi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Henry Neftali Mendes Torres. Iliana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. Present. José Marcos Rodríguez Ayala. Present. José Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Rebeca Yasmin Monterrosa Figueroa. Present. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Estefania Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Wilman Frank Figueroa Peñate. Present. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Okay, okay, okay. Just a second. Okay, well, guys, uh, we need to go to the manual because there's something also in my lesson plan that uh, it's related to the manual. We need also to work. And there is something interesting there, new vocabulary. Well, not new vocabulary, but a new context. And that's always good for you. So let me share with you from the manual. Here we go. On page number 19, exercise two, Alan is reporting some questions a customer who's visiting their website is asking. Read the conversation to find out the answers Maria suggests. Take turns practicing the conversation with a partner. Okay, the conversation goes like this. 
There's this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows. What would the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return policy. Let's let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost and tell them the pillows were made in China. And please post a link in the comments to the return policy document. I repeat. There's this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows. What would the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return policy. Let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost and tell them the pillows were made in China. And please post a link in the comments to the return policy document. Okay, guys. Now let me... Let me get you in groups so you can start practicing. Give me just a second that I need to do a little change here. Perfect. Groups are created, please jump in. Hello guys. Hello. Rebecca. Rebecca. <laughs> I need to talk to you. Uh, okay. <laughs> Yesterday you left me as the, the proverbial, uh, let's see, town bride. Como novia de oh, yeah, como, yeah. <laughs> como novia vestida y alborotada. Yeah. Um, can I call I on you hear. for tonight, Rebecca? After yes. the class, can you stay a couple of minutes, please? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, last I'm night sure. I was excited and then Rebecca just disconnected and I was like, man. <laughs> what happened? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, my, my, my bell was calling me. Yeah, I, I can understand that. I can understand. Don't worry, don't worry. That but happens. Tonight, please stay. I got some very good tips that are going to be helpful for you. Okay. For sure. Okay, okay ladies, I'll let you practice. Okay, perfect. perfect. So let's switch. Uh -huh. so you, mm -hmm. Okay. There's this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillow. Decorative. 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 
interesting for us. What would, what would the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free and then the same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pilots were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return policy. Return. Yeah. Return. Okay. Decorative. 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 Okay. No, like this, like this. I'm sorry. The, the correct correct pronunciation goes like decorative. 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 Okay. Decorative. Decorative. Okay. Let me finish. So let, let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost. And tell them the pilots were made in China. And please post a link in the comments to the return policy. Okay. okay. There is this customers, this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillow. What would the customer like to know about the product? I'm sorry to interrupt. Decorative. 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 Pillow. Decorative. Decorative. Okay. Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return policy. Return. Return. Let the customer know that international shipping has an, an extra cost. And then, then the pilots were made in China. And please post a link in the comment to the return police document. Okay. Okay. I start. There is the customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pilots. What will the customer like to know about, about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then the same person posted a different question. They asked whether the pilots were made in China or America. Okay, guys, let's see who's gonna be first. Mm -hmm. Jacqueline and Ada and let's see Jacqueline you'll start okay teacher um okay I'm Alan there is there is this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows Ada? Sorry, teacher, sorry. Mute. <laughs> what would the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then the same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return police. Police. Yes. Policy. Let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost. And tell me, tell them the pilots were pillows. Were, pillows. pillows were made in China. And please post a link in the comments to the return policy document. Okay, document. 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 It's pillow, yes? Yes. 
Okay. okay thank, thank you, you, ladies. Uh, Frank and Stephanie. Frank, please start. Okay, teacher. Okay. There's this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows. What will the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have return policy. Let the customer know that that international shipping has an extra cost and tell them that the pillows were made in China. And please post a link, post a link in the comments to, re to the return policy document. Perfect. Christine, thank you. Jose Smith and Ramon. Jose Smith, you will start. Okay. Uh... There are this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the, the curative pillows. What would the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked, so if the shipping was for free, and then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked, so if we have a return policy. Let the customer know that the international shipping has an extra cost and tell them that pillows were made in China. And please post a link in the comments to the return policy document. Okay, perfect. Just remember, uh, decorative, decorative. 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 Uh, div. It's div at the end. Yeah, like uh, you say the pronunciation of the word, like if, if it had a D. D decorative. Yeah, decorative. Decorative. Oh, decorative. Ima uh, look in the Zoom chat. Imagine that at the end you are pronouncing this. Div. Decorative. Okay, decorative. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you. you. Marcos and Henry, Neftali, please. Marcos, you'll start. There are these customers in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows. What about the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free, and then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have our return policy. Let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost and tell them the people were made in China. And please post a link in the comment, comment to the return policy document. Perfect, guys. Thank you very much. Maria Alejandra and Rebecca. Rebecca, you'll start. Okay. There's this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows. What would the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if we shipping was for free. And then the same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pills were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return policy. Let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost and tell them the pillows were made in China. And please post a link in the comments to their return policy document. Policy. Policy. 
Thank you, ladies. Susana and Roxana. Roxana, you'll start. Okay, let me see. There is there is this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows. What would the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return pol policy. Let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost and tell them that pillow, pillow were made, made in China. And please post a, like, a link in the comments to the ret return policy document. Document, document. Thank you, ladies. Document. Francisco and Fernando. Fernando, you'll start. Okay, okay teacher. Uh, there's there's this customer in the online store asking a lot of questions about the decorative pillows. What will the customer like to know about the product? Well, the customer asked if the shipping was for free. And then this same person posed a different question. They asked whether the pillows were made in China or America. And finally, the customer asked if we have a return policy. Let the customer know that international shipping has an extra cost and tell them the pillow were made in China. And please post a link in the comment to the return policy document. Perfect. Thank you very much, guys. Okay, now, 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 now. I got, let's continue with our conversation section. Any question about the conversation we just did, about the vocabulary? No, okay, perfect. Now guys, companies, we're gonna change subject. We are going to talk about jobs. Are there any companies you would like to work for? If so, why? We are going to discuss this working in the same groups we were working now. We are going to create new groups so you can have the chance to participate with your with other taskmates. Please jump into the groups. You got five minutes for this activity. No, actually eight. I'm sorry. I was taking back. Eight minutes for this activity. Please jump in. So, are, are there any companies 
you would like to work for by any chance? Oh, well, I think, yes. Here in Metafon, for, for example, there is the, the housing company. And I don't know, I, I don't know that when I was on the, on the high school, I visited that company. And I like the system for make the, the product, the different products and, and, and the, all the process. So I would like to work there. So basically what's your dream? So, and also I still uh, dreaming for you, <laughs> right? <Yeah. laughs> like a dream, just a dream. <laughs> Nice, really nice. And um, about me, so yeah, so I remember that let's see, around five or seven years ago. Uh -huh. So I heard about a uh, like, uh, I don't know how to say this. Like, so that is the, the, the component X lab. Yeah. Microsoft. So that is basically the, the that account is for Telus. So uh -huh. and that account is really nice for me because I heard around seven years ago about that account that is really nice. So and basically, so I really want it to work on that place. So in order that, that I can get the knowledge about Microsoft. Okay. So it's like a call center? Mm -hmm. Yep. For call Microsoft, center. okay. Mm -hmm. But that, that account is just uh, in size. I think mm -hmm. just size has that account. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. that, that is just for the basically the product that they the Microsoft has right so mm -hmm. I really interested in that but actually working so like in a center so it's I have experience but that is kind of tricky right sometimes with the taking calls but uh -huh. I think that it, that for the, the thing that I will be really nice is the money and when I want uh, yes. Is yes, um, private hospital or the yeah. hospital? Private, private. private oh my, Seguro Social. Yes, I was, I was there. So I remember that I, I went, I don't remember what day, but it was at, in the morning. And then I returned the next. Uh, yeah. uh, I would like work. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Well, I, I think it's uh, always uh, I, I like me working in a in a company uh, related, for example, uh, or a port. Or an airport, or or industrial, uh, that the process, uh, uh, that the the process uh, are uh, how how do you say um, uh, complex complex. For example, um, I. Uh, I, I was uh, uh, working uh, in the refiner uh, in, here in Acajutla. Uh -huh. This is a uh, this is a industry that uh, the process are very complex, oh. and and I I uh, I like me that working uh, in a company with a uh, a complex process. 
uh, for example, <laughs> that uh, uh, Henry is, uh, said uh, if you like working in the NASA, <laughs> uh, the process uh, very, very complex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very, very complex, but I think that the NASA needs a specific um, career because they mm. have, they have, it, uh, it they have a lot the, of professionals. It depends on the area because uh, NASA, uh, 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 the has, areas, uh, his, his areas. Yeah. It they have a lot, of, a lot of professionals in different areas. Yes. But, but, but always like me, the activities that they do and the concept that they develop in the countries that, that they are, actually. So, yeah, I, I would like him foul sometime, sometime. Which one? Foul. Oh, interesting. Do you like to work for them? Yeah, yeah, I always, yeah, I aim to, to work for them, but I hope sometime work, work in that organization. I really like the things that they do and the concept that they do. We are talking about agriculture and, and yes. right? Food sustain sustainability. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Things like that. Yeah, yeah, we are on the same page. Yes, yes. So I hope <laughs> I hope to have the opportunity to work for them in the future. Mm, that's quite interesting. Yes, I really like that kind of organization. Yeah, they are from the UN, right? Yes, yes. The United Nations. Yes, of course. Yeah, those kind of organization I really like. Yeah, and they pay good. <laughs> that's what I heard. <laughs> yeah, no, that's a plus. I mean, you do what you like and they pay good. That's cool. Ah, okay. Yeah, of course. That, that, mm. That's the better. Keep right? on working with your English. Yeah, yeah, of course. That's why I'm, I'm here right now. <laughs> <laughs> that's the idea. Yeah, that's the idea improving myself okay guys 60 seconds and we go back okay 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 thank you. Let's wait for everybody to come back in a few seconds. Okay, let's see who's going to start, who's going to start, who's going to start, let's see. Maria Alejandra, tell me, you are the first volunteer. Are there any companies you would like to work for? 
I don't know, teacher. Uh, in my case, I think that only have a, a different opportunity in an insurance company. Maybe I'd like to work in uh, Asia Suiza okay. or the uh, other insurance company uh, stay out the El Salvador or the extranjera. Rain. Uh -huh, rain. Um, only that, teacher. I think okay. that uh, it's a That's good time. That's fine, that's fine, no problem, no problem. Marcos, what about you? Tell me, are there any companies you would like to work for? Uh, yeah, I would like to work for Google. Okay, Google. Well, uh, because I think they have a friendly work policy. <laughs> I don't know, I read an article saying that. Hey, it's a very attractive company for you. Yes. Stephanie, what about you? Thank you, Marcus. That's so funny because when I was talking with my partners, I mentioned Google too. <laughs> because I saw some videos on, on TikTok and there is a, this girl that show to the people how it works from Google and I like the... For example, they have uh, their own chef and they have a refrigerator with the junk food and healthy food. And they have uh, uh, different partners from different countries. And the main language uh, should be English, but they are from different countries, from China, from Spain, from the United States. So I choose you, choose Google too. So when yeah, I yeah. listen, Marcos, I was like, wow, it's the same. <laughs> yeah, the Google, uh, their facilities are very impressive. And the working environment also is very attractive for a lot of people. That's interesting. Thank you. Now let's see, Rebecca, what about you? Well, I was talking with my partner that I would like to work for um, Hosing. It's the company that is in charge to, to make the cement here in El Salvador. Yeah. And, it, mm. and we have two plants here in Metapan. Oh, you really will be fun. close. You will be close yeah. home, close, close to your family. That's cool. Yeah. I like it because in the past I had the opportunity to visit the, the, the plants and see the products, be in contact with the different uh, components and I like it. I really like the process. Okay, cool. Interesting. Pretty yeah. interesting. Thank you, Rebecca. Jacqueline, what about you? I can make your microphone, please. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, the chair was looking. Um, well, uh, I'm uh, starting to become a teacher, but I would like to have a job in a, I don't know, how do you say, um, Ministerio de Educación? In a, for a public school? Yes, for a public school, because teachers okay. that work on, on that school has better opportunities, um, more benefits. Yeah, sure. What's your specialty? A, a kindergarten. Preschool. Preschool, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's always skills. Excellent, thank you. Thank you. Fernando, what about you? What you got from me? Oh, but I I choose I choose Google too. But okay. For according to my possibilities in this country, I really I would like to work for Telus. Sorry? Telus. Oh Telus. Oh nice. Nice environment. Uh, good salaries. It's a it's a nice place, actually. Yeah. Uh, 
as far as I know, it's a, uh, I mean, they got pretty good benefits for the employees. Yeah, but I need to speak English in a good level. Yeah. Yeah, they are a little bit demanding on that. Yeah. No, yeah. But I, the good news is I'm here. Yeah, of course. I'm here prepare, prepare me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, who knows? Perhaps you can make it there. Yeah. It would be well, a nice experience. Yeah, sure. Yeah, well, one day we know. Yeah, excellent. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Now, guys. Yeah, if you notice, I mean, society and the demands of society are, sorry, and the demands of society are changing, uh, I mean, constantly, and every year, well, some new companies appear, some new products, some new services appear, but some others disappear. Now I got a question for you. Tell me, what kind of business might have trouble surviving in the future? What do you think? Do you think there's a, any type of business that perhaps in the future it will be hard for them to survive? Why? Let's talk a little bit about that. You will have five minutes to have that small conversation, okay? And I'll send you to the groups right about now. Please jump in and let's talk about it. Let's analyze that. La semana. Uh -huh, yeah, yeah, it's me here. <laughs> yeah, the teacher is a problem, you know, it's complex. Okay, then I'm gone. Is it? Uh, that disappeared because, uh, because there are. Uh, Many companies that uh, working in this in this model for uh, how do you say substitute your teacher? Substitute or, or replace or replace okay and uh, replace that the human uh, for example uh, in in some areas, uh, Tesla, uh, uh, they uh, working in in system that that uh, the cars are driving. Uh, uh, is automatic driving, and uh, every every day the system is most. Uh, uh, is most professional or, or is is most uh, enough for realize that uh, that that uh, the tax uh, and this is this is an uh, uh, example. Uh, there are many areas in the the computer. Uh, it's, it's time is 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 
is most uh, the depressing is 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 a thing is 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 most is more sorry it's more. I think yeah, but what what was the the name of of that type of appearances? Uh, remember like go, like go. Uh, yeah yeah oh. but that's uh, that the people say uh, uh, and then you see I don't remember the word that was yeah, me neither, but the, the thing is that since that time, we are not watching TV. <laughs> For me, uh, in my case, I, I think um, cyber or housing, there are many computers to connect to internet. Uh, with the pass of the time, it will be no longer helpful or use, useful because now every everyone have internet in in their own home. So it's a business that is not be very useful in the future. I think. Yeah, exactly. Your see your see your office. Sorry, guys. The system supposedly give you gives you sixty seconds after I click on it, but right now I just realized that it just kicked you out, right? So let's see, let's see, let's see. What type of business do you think are going to disappear in the future, Frank? Well, teacher, we talk with with the partners about all kind of TV shows, maybe we'll have troubles in the future, <laughs> right? Why do you think uh, so? Mostly, mostly uh, the break news and those kind of, of TV shows. Because, I mean, we have social networks right now, right? So, obviously, they will have some profit in futures in the future right yeah or unless they adapt yeah oh, yeah of course they have to adapt they will have to adapt. Yeah. interesting thank you and what do you think about it nicolas do you think of any type of business that will disappear in the future well, in this moment, I don't remember because, for example, in my group, uh, the opinion is uh, while well, the accountant is very, is very difficult, uh, is very difficult work in the future, uh, but uh, because uh, today is necessary the technology for this activity. Okay, perfect. And Ada, what do you think? What's your opinion? Uh, and the group is the mirror, o sea, the misma opinion. In my case, okay. teacher, I might say uh, the medicine without the for the sub specialty, specialty, and do specialties. the, the socialties, uh, yeah. specialties specialties to the appearance of the minimal uh, minimal invasive or is a little it's a little 
open surgery for the oh. advanced technology is my specialty. Interesting. Thank you. Yes. It's a very expensive teacher. Yeah, I can imagine. I can imagine. <laughs> Roxana, what about you? What's your opinion? Well, we was talking about the accounting because, uh, well, it's my area. And I consider that in the future, that company that uh, don't work in a technology firm present trouble in the future because uh, actually some uh, company, some leader companies work with uh, invoice, physical invoice and books, accounting books. So, you know, they need to uh, assign and uh, sellar, no sé cómo se dice, sellar los libros. Seal, seal. Seal the books and it's totally manual. It's a manual process all the cycle, all the accounting cycle. So to be honest, I think that in the future, uh, all companies need to, uh, to use a uh, accounting system to present the information to the, um, I don't know, the, the, the bus or maybe when they have a audit, because if uh, the audit uh, is present today, maybe he can ask for a report at that day. And if the company don't use a system, accounting system, they can't present because they don't have the report a este día. No sé cómo decirle eso. Ellos no tienen un reporte a este día. now up to now so they need to prepare their report and present then but if they work with a system the process it will be easy but now the leader companies work with physical document so it's complex to the future i think okay now, guys, let me get the attendance one last time, please. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Ambarelli Alparo Gómez. Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Thank you. Jairi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Henry Neftalí Méndez Torres. Here I am, teacher. Ileana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. Present. José Marcos Rodríguez Ayala. Present. José Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. José Wilfredo Ayala Soto. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Rebeca Yasmin Monterrosa Figueroa. Present. Roxana Ivet Asencio de Mejía. Present. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Milman Frank Figueroa Peñate. Present. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Well, I hope all of you get a good weekend. Please don't forget working on the platform. I'm always checking and updating your grades. So if you can advance, better. And well, that's it. Have a good weekend. Enjoy it. See you Monday. Take care. Thank you. Bye bye. Good weekend. Thank you. Have a good weekend. Teacher, one question. Yep. Uh, when is the deadline to do the homework? 
the, the one that I left yesterday. No, no. Or the uh, platform. The platform, the platform, yeah, platform. Okay, we are working on section two. You, you still got next week to finish section two and midterm. Okay, okay. Uh, at the end of the next week, we have yep. to finish. Already finished the section, section two. Section, yep, and midterm. Okay, okay. Uh, um, I don't know if the problems with platform are really... Uh, I will ask, I will try to find out tomorrow morning because I sent the report and they told me that they yesterday they were going to work on it. Oh, okay, okay, perfect. Because uh, I, I have no, problem, no problem, no problem. Okay. Don't worry, don't worry. Have a good one. Perfect, Take teacher. Care. Bye. Okay, okay, teacher. Good night. Have a happy good. weekend. Same to you. Rebecca, hello, how are you? Hello, sir. Hi, I um, imagine. <laughs> uh, a little bit enjoying the, the, the weather in Metapan. Oh, yeah, I can imagine. Yeah, it's fresh. Yeah, delicious. Yeah. Okay, it's really good my... for, for drink. <laughs> Yes. Okay, my dear. You got, well, actually, you got a very good command of English. And right now, what I would like you to do is to, to increase your vocabulary. How are you okay. going to do it? I just sent you some info. Check out the, 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 I'll send it to the, to your, uh, 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 let's see. Awesome. No, I'll send it also to your WhatsApp sister like that, so you okay. can save it, okay? And what I want you to do is check out the info I just sent you, check out all the different options. Give mm -hmm. me just a second, please. Rem remember, the idea is for you to practice. That's the only way you're going to actually improve in your vocabulary. So... Uh, what I would like you to do is to do the exercises and perhaps in one week, if you're having any type of trouble, let me know and I will I will set apart a few minutes so I can help you. Okay. I'll be working on it. You're <laughs> falling asleep, Rebecca. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, I hear that you're like going down. <laughs> no, and tell me, is there any topic that is giving you problem that you would like me to help you especially with? Well, no, right now, no, just the, the, the problem that you already identified, the, my vocabulary is bad. <laughs> yeah, well, no, your vocabulary is not bad. It's just that you need a little bit more. And that's normal. Oh. I mean, that's normal. Uh, remember that we are not working in we are not living in a english speaking country and yeah. and that uh affects it's a it's a big influence something else that i want to share with you is this look uh, if you look in the platform you got this access right mm -hmm. okay if you come all the way down you will find centro de ayuda you see it mm -hmm. sí. yes Okay, you come to Centro de Ayuda. Again, you come all the way down and you get into Recursos Académicos. You got grammar, pronunciation, mm -hmm. vocabulary, and video conferences. So, and this is like grammar, it's by levels. Grammar, you got basic, intermediate, advanced. Mm -hmm. You got of many, many things. In vocabulary, man, there's a bunch. If you notice, we got everyday activities, personal care products, household cleaning and laundry. Now, this is very interesting because if you notice, the vocabulary is a specific topic. And mm -hmm. look, there's a lot. Yes. <laughs> so, uh, something else that you could try is this. Get here, get vocabulary about one topic, 
something that is something that is related to to your daily life okay mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. like i mean you start with those ones so you leave for the end the ones that are not like that much for you like babies do you have any babies no you're not married right no so this one is like not that attractive for you no but animals and pets yes <laughs> okay so you see uh -huh. you start looking and then you will get to more and more and more but if you do it just one at a time okay one yeah. or if you if you check it like today you use it tomorrow try to apply the vocabulary on on your daily life on a context that you are mm -hmm. comfortable with okay yes okay uh, you don't forget how to get here no. no. Okay. Excellent. Now that's what uh that's what I have for you, so you can start and let me know if it if you feel like it doesn't work because that happens. I mean, not not everybody learns the same way. Perhaps for you you got a different style of learning. I can get you different material. That's really true. <laughs> Yeah. Everyone have has his has his method. Yeah. But I will and have it. Check it out and and let me know. Okay, I'm here to help. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. Go to sleep, my dear. You need it. <laughs> In a few minutes. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much for staying with me. Have a good night. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> Well, that was it for today. A very interesting class. Over the weekend. See you Monday.